Hey guys, anybody out there? My guts are on the outside. I'm waiting for somebody to come in and heal me up. Anybody there? You guys want to see this, so you should probably like join me. Who is it? Who's there? Bianca! Sean! What's up? I'm laying it all out for y'all. Who else is out there? Who's gonna join? Britt! Hey Britt! What's up girl? I'm just standing here in my Guts uniform drinking rosé on ice being super class waiting for more people to join me. Hey Fabby! What's up, girl? How's it going? You could wear this to cadaver training, um, but I really like it. So I don't know that I can part with it yet. It's pretty awesome. Hey, girl. How you doing? Your dog's cute. So... <clears throat> I see I have some people with me now, which is super fun. Um, I went to the bins yesterday because my parents took Sully overnight. They were super excited about it. Now that they're retired, they're just like, we don't have anything to do. So we'll take your kid, which is like win, 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 win for everybody. Even though he always wants to just come home at like 7 30 p.m. when I've had a glass of wine or two and I'm just like no you have to stay there oh my god John because why freaking not yes date nights amazing um John you don't have to watch this um but I thought that people would want to see me in this so this is what's gonna happen good I got some people hanging out with me now. And I'm going to show you a couple things I got at the bins because when my kid was away, that's what I did. Well, I did more than that. But anyway, this plastic guts thing. Whoa, that's not a good angle. It's like pregnant intestines. Anyways, I got this and it was awesome. I'm going to keep wearing it. And let me show you what else I got. This is super cute. And I'm going to try to get Sully to wear it, but I don't know. I know you can't look away. It's amazing. Um, this is a super vintage kids t-shirt, but it's a San Francisco cable car and it's like super eighties. And I don't know if Soli will wear it or not, but, oh, it's 1985. But isn't that so cute? Oh my God. You used to go to the bins on date nights too? Man, I loved it. I like put on my headphones and I was listening to I Think You Freaky. If you haven't listened to that, please listen to it because it's amazing. So, um, I also got this guy, which is kind of stupid, but this is a little eighties guy, a little lion with a trumpet. He's not worth a lot of money, but he's really cute. Somebody will buy him for like 10 bucks and he's basically free. So I'll take it anyways. There goes that guy. I'm going to keep this on because it looks so good. This is something Chris found, which was, is really cool. It's a 1940s wool military jacket. God, it looks good with the guts. It's so amazing. It's really cute. I'm a little too chubby for it, which is sad, but I am. I really want to wear it. But God, it's cute. It's got these little loop zippers. Very 40s, 100% wool. I love tags. I love old tags. Check that one out. It even smells good. Hey, Jamie. It's like some really good smelling um, Halloween costume. Maybe. It's never too soon for Halloween. It's my favorite. I used to have some really great Halloween parties, you guys, before I had a child, like, super epic, amazing decorated great costumes and contests yeah it's itchy um 
but it's really cute and if I was 20 pounds lighter I would wear it for sure um let's see what else did I get this is kind of fun I got this Super Mario Brothers backpack and it has a little Mario and it's like it's got some Japanese writing I think which is cute Sully didn't seem to like it but I think somebody else will because Mario's hot right always always hot so that was awesome um now I have a little bit of an obsession with vintage linens like it's borderline a problem um but I did pull out this one which is beautiful it's a tablecloth and it's actually in really nice condition and I just love this stuff you guys and this one is much bigger but it's like the <clears throat> it's cherries and it's really really like thick flower sack material and these are like surprisingly not very stained which is kind of unusual lots of times there's a big old stain from when people used to sit at a table and like pass the gravy and then like gravy's all over the place I don't know I don't know why gravy comes to mind but I'm guessing that's what people used gravy your husband won't let you have <laughs> I guess I know what I'm bringing to your house next week I don't know where you live but I'll figure it out because that'd be creepy like that. Um, okay guys, what else? This, okay, one more linen because I know they're not super exciting for everybody, but this one is so cute. It's like applique birds and it's square. These are the only birds on it, but it is so cute on a little tea table. Ugh. Somebody threw out all their linens recently from the 40s and 50s, and I procured them. Because I'm magic like that. Procuring your crap. Here's another thing. Yeah, all the doilies. All of them. You just like doily, like staple to the wall. Do it. Um, this is like super grandma weird but this is a um i can't tell if it's sterling or silver plate but this is from warsaw poland and it's pretty old i got this last night and so the problem with this guy is he's a little crooked but it is marked warsaw poland and um this is pretty cool i saw a pair of these sell for like 180 bucks but I only have one and the one I have is broke is crooked so it's probably an as-is kind of situation but it's pretty awesome this guy has little um he's got little lions he's really cool really cool does anyone else drink rosé on ice or is it just me it's so hot today it's like melting I just went outside and my poor chickens didn't have any water. I'm just, I was really failing at caring for things today. But I will care for myself and I'll keep giving myself. Oh, it's a candlestick. What is rosé or what is a candlestick? Because one of those you should know. Girl. Um, oh my god. This came out of the book bin. And I tend to see, oh, I just lost a couple of my viewers. I must be boring the crap out of people right now. I tend to see a lot of children's books. Rosé is a wine. It's a pink wine for the classy bitches only. Um, this book uh, caught my attention because I look through the book bit I look through a lot of books and you see the same books over and over again but I've never seen this book um, or this author which looks like it says Wolo which I don't know what that is but um, it's called Tweedles Be Brave and it's from 1943 and there's another one there's one on eBay that didn't sell for like 150 bucks so 
nobody's buying it for 150 bucks just because they're asking it doesn't mean that's what it's worth but um this book is awesome and the fact that there is only one and they were asking that made me grab it because i only paid a quarter for it kids books at the bins are 25 cents so if you want to be going to barnes and noble and be spending 14.99 on a book for a kid do that like i don't care but you can also get i got a stack of really cool books for four bucks and um, it's hit or miss, but sometimes it's super amazing. So if you can stomach it and you love kids books and you don't want to spend a million dollars, I'm just saying, um, ha, <laughs> you're obsessed. I know. So interesting. Curious George goes to the strip club. Close. Close. Uh, what else? I didn't find that much more. Um, I'm going to show this. It's really stupid, but so you, did you know, look at this. Did you know that, um, oh, mildly racist. So this book, John, um, I haven't read it yet, so I don't know, but you are correct in assuming that that is a possibility. I'll read it and I'll let you know, but I have to be really careful with it because the binding is really fragile. So I'll let you know. Um, <laughs> so I think these emoji products are super stupid. But um, this one, uh, did you guys know that J. Crew makes a line of clothes for kids called Crew Cuts? Well, they do. Um, but this is, uh, here, I'll show you the label. This is by Crew Cuts, and it's always super overpriced, and it's like just, it's fine. But it's not like magic shit or anything. Um, but this little glitter emoji purse, like somebody paid 25 bucks for this on eBay and I got it for like 50 cents. So I'm going to make 25 bucks off that if Sully doesn't try to steal it because he really likes an emoji, which is like, really? You got better taste than that kid. Uh, you must review. I'm going to review it and, um, I'm going to let you know because I thought the same thing. Okay, what else did I get? I got a, some just other stuff that's boring that I'm not gonna talk about because it's really stupid. Um, and then some little stuff. Like, who's this guy? Does anybody know? Is this like Wolfman? Who's that? Anybody know? And I also got this gorilla. Like, look at his face. He's amazing. And he's from the 80s. And you know, I grew up in the 80s, so I pretty much gotta get all the 80s shit. I think this is like Wolfman. Beast from X-Men? Sweet, thank you. I don't follow any of that kind of stuff, so I always have to ask people because I don't know. Um, I think that's it for now. I just wanted to come on because I needed to like get away from my family for a little while. What are you guys doing? I guess that's about it. It's a million degrees. So I'm glad we have AC. Sure girl. I hope you have a nice week, Fabby cutting some hair. Do you do color? I need some new color. I really want some kind of like a cinnamon fading to like blonde. Although my hair is pretty fried. So I'm hoping it won't fall out. But I've got this gray stripe happening, which grosses me out. I hate it. I know there's a, those people who are like, I love the gray. And that's, I like, I wish I could be that person, but I'm not. I don't like it it makes me sad and it makes me feel old and I'm gonna be 40 in less than two weeks and so I can't I can't be having this guys can't be having this this gray yeah anyway hey Zoe how are you girl Zoe's my cousin 
She just graduated from nursing school and she's looking for a nursing job. So somebody hook her up. Give that girl a job. She's cute and she's nice and she would be a great nurse for you. Anyway, alright. I love you guys. If I find more shit to show, I'll come back on later. Peace!